I am making this quick video um, because I have to. I don't want to. I didn't think I was going to have to because I really thought that the person that was commenting and commenting and commenting and twisting and twisting what I said over and over and over again on my last video that I made wasn't going to be there anymore. Because after they accused me of stuff, and when you accuse someone of something that they didn't do, and you continue to accuse them of it, and they continue to say, I didn't do it, and you continue to accuse them of it, you're calling them a liar. Do you understand that? In the context of that, you're calling them a liar. Okay? I never said anything about patriotic people. What I said was those people who claim to be patriots that would dismantle the Constitution, put church into legislation, take away freedom of speech and what you're going to read and how you're going to do what you do, they're not patriots because a patriot would not dismantle the Constitution. And the patriot, the word patriot that I use is the original word of patriot that was someone who would follow the Constitution and never follow a king again. I don't know how more clear I can make that. Now we have our freedom of speech being taken away, our freedom of religion being taken away. So what I'm trying to tell you is the people that claim to be a patriot but is will but are willing to dismantle the constitution are not patriots not in the sense of an american patriot when you're so worried about the second amendment but you're not worried about the first amendment because you think that it should be a Christian nation and legislation should be with Christian values, then you're not a patriot because the Constitution says there is a separation of state, church and state. There's also the freedom of speech. So if I want to say gay, I can say gay. But Florida, they sign in, don't say gay. And then you have Sarah Huckabee taking words that you can't say anymore out of their government. So yes, the people that claim to be patriots that are dismantling the Constitution, putting church and value, church values, Christian values into legislation, they're not patriots. The people that would follow Trump as he dismantled the Constitution are not patriots. That's what I'm saying. And to that person, I do think you have a mental disorder. And you're causing me to have one. Because I've never been this angry from a video before. But you said you weren't going to come back. And you did. And you've done exactly what you've done before. Twisting words. And I try very hard to be patient. And re restate it again and again and again. I think you have a mental issue or a psychological issue of some sort, and I think you need to stop. But if anyone wants to see what's been going on, go to my last video, look in the comments, and you're going to see craziness. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> I invite you to, please, so that I don't know, so that I don't think I'm crazy, <laughs> but it's driving me crazy. So please, just don't come back. If you don't like what I'm saying, or if you don't like how I've explained myself, get over it and go on, because there's plenty of other YouTube channels to go to. I don't know why you're hanging on to me, because you need to go. I need you to go. I'm not going to ban you, because if I do some really good animal videos, I don't want you not to be able to see them. Or if I do shopping videos and you're interested, or if I'm doing cooking videos. But don't twist my words. Take what I say for how I say it. If you don't agree, don't agree. Make your comment. I will reply. And then that's it. Not the constant stuff. So I do, I do recommend everybody to go back to the last video 
and see what the heck I'm talking about. But I really want this viewer to be gone. I, I, I've never said that before. I've never done any of that before. And I've been called some horrible names. <laughs> So that's it. That's all. Y'all have a great night. I got this off my chest and um, whew, it's hotter than heck here in the warmest room of the house. It's time to get on comfy clothes and go relax. Y'all have a good night. Bye. Hugs from a distance.